Welcome back to Belief in Fatherhood. My name is Belief, and uh, we tell real stories of fatherhood. Recently, I've been washing the kids' feet, and I wanted to update you on how they're doing with some of the challenges I gave them doing the foot washing. Uh, Theo and Uriah both got their feet washed. I challenged Uriah to clean his room. I challenged Theo to clean the bathroom all by themselves. Uh, and they kind of stepped up, man. And so I wanted to show you that. Check it out. Can you tell the camera what you're doing today? Cleaning the bathroom. And you made shoes, so when you get inside, can you spray it down first before you get in there? It's gonna be helpful. What spray? Spray it down with water. Where's your list of things that you have to do? And I did not do this. I have to clean the bathroom. Okay, and so you made your list, you got all your tools, and you're gonna get it done. Meanwhile, Uriah is cleaning the room. Cleaning to your bed. Well, I want you to clean up the floor first. I want everything off the floor. That's the main thing. And everything where it belongs, okay? So you see how all these papers are in this area? You can't put nothing on top of there, so get rid of that. You see how all this trash is over here and all these pencils? You can't do anything with all this. Pick up all the colored pencils and put the colored pencils where they go. They go in that tub, right? Yeah. Huh? I learned making paper towel shoes is a bad one. That's what you learned? That's okay. I feel like that's a good lesson. So why are you saying you can't get out? Because I don't want to get out of here with my bare feet and actually clean it and then clean it. Yeah, you're going to have to clean it. That's what happens. kind of told you, but it's okay. Take those off and keep it going. You're doing great. Oh, you got us a toilet now. And look at the mirror. My goodness, it looks good. Jeez. It looks like I did it. Wow, Theo. That's a good job on the mirror, man. Theo can clean windows now. <laughs> good job Theo, good job Raya, keep going. Right now is a season of guiding, coaching, you know. Um, we're instructing them on which way they should be going. We're not expecting them to be perfect or, or kill it and, you know, be, be flawless. Um, but we are expecting them to rise to the occasion and accept challenges that we do have coming to them. Um, and you know, they probably perceive that as not being fair right now, but I, and I understand that. And uh, the challenges are definitely more difficult from one than the other. Um, and that's OK, because, um, you know, I do like some of you guys reached out after a shooting the Uriah video, um, me washing his feet. And they were saying like he might be ADD or something like that. And so Yvette and I are definitely like very like in tune with our children and know that, like, you know, you know, they may be something that needs more attention. You know what I'm saying? So we're aware. Um, but we're not so quick to just be like, I, I diagnosed with you, you with this. Um, just because, you know, like, I think we want to give ourselves time to see if like, Hey, this is this a season. Is this something he's going through, you know, just as he's developing and, um, you know, brain developing or issues with, um, you know, uh, uh, being upset about something and not being able to, uh, communicate it. And so we're very patient. Um, even though sometimes we're not, you know, and I definitely got to work on that, um, that I'm challenging him but not exasperating him. Um, but yeah, like in the same with Theo, like, you know, stepping up and really trying to work hard to, to make dad proud and all that stuff, you know? Um, I also want him to be proud of his own work. Uh, so there's, this is a lot of guiding and, and developing right now uh, as Theo is eight and Uriah is about to be seven, guys. Um, I was doing all these videos and Yvette was like, when are you gonna wash my feet? You know what I'm saying? So our birthday is coming up. So maybe we'll do a little video about that uh, and, you know, how we've been connecting lately. But yeah, man, I just wanted to update you guys. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I hope you guys are enjoying life, you know, and um, using uh, letting us be the muse for, you know, the relationships that you have, you know, that we're not doing it perfect. And that is OK, you know, and that uh, you may be able to see where you can try harder and you may be able to see where you can you know, work on your own self-care and, and really pursue yourself in certain ways. Uh, so I'm very proud of you. I'm very, I'm very proud of you. You know what I'm saying? For choosing, um, 
you know, yourself when you do choosing your family. I think people who watch this channel know that family is foundation. And so they prioritize it or they hope to prioritize it. Um, and so I just want to let you know, I'm proud of you, man. Um, uh, yeah, I hope that your weekend is great. Thank you guys so much for watching Protect Your Life. Keep the network popping. If you're fortunate enough to be doing life with someone else, make sure you watch this video with them. If they're not around, share it with them. See y'all next time. Peace.